Baik, dan kemudian uh, kita berlanjut untuk mengetahui informasi selanjutnya. Unjuk rasa berangsur ricuh di tepi barat pasca pengakuan Trump terkait Yerusalem sebagai ibu kota Israel. Warga Palestina melampiaskan kemarahan kepada Amerika Serikat dan juga Israel. Mereka pun kecewa dengan pemimpin Palestina yang dianggap kurang bertindak. Bentrok terjadi setelah pemimpin Arab memperingatkan kemarahan akan meluap di Timur Tengah. Ian Lee turun ke tepi barat untuk memberikan laporan selengkapnya untuk Anda. An American flag going forward. Uh, this man's waving it. He's he's walking, uh, walking forward. Let's just see what he uh, he does with it. Uh, it looks like he's uh, he's putting it into the uh, the tires that are on fire there. Uh, he's, he's burning the flag. And this is the anger that we've seen directed towards the United States. Uh, you know, people angry about President Trump's decision yesterday. You know, this battle, though, uh, we've seen Palestinians throwing rocks. They have slingshots. Uh, the Israelis are about, oh, two, three hundred meters in that direction. Uh, they've been firing rubber bullets. And uh, earlier they let loose a barrage of tear gas. And uh, that uh, really sent everyone scrambling. But uh, uh, you can see here just people are, are gathering more rocks moving forward and throwing them in that direction. You can't see the Israelis because they're covered with this black, thick smoke. But uh, you know, this is the violence that a lot of Arab leaders warned that could happen. Now, will this sustain itself? That's to be seen. But today, this is the largest protest in this area that we've seen in quite a long time. Uh, people out here, you know, on the front line, you have uh, men and women throwing rocks uh, in, in that direction. It, it's a real, uh, a lot of people are just really angry. That's all, that's all you can say, directed towards uh, the Americans, directed towards the Israelis. Uh, and, you know, there is some anger towards the Palestinian leadership, frustration that they don't believe that they're doing enough. But uh, today, as you can see, uh, they're just venting that anger, venting that frustration.